look at you you're using with your own someone's daughter that's a no chance you're using withdraw withdraw like you put it in an <laughs> anyway anyway let's see like why shouldn't you like i'm assuming you know what we are talking about like trying to prevent pregnancy by just you know some people call it coitus interrupt us but i think scientists but who uses withdraw to prevent pregnancy anyway let's see like why why we don't have to use withdraw if you're using it did you know that most unintended pregnancies especially among the teenage girls uh, school going age adolescent girls it's the same category and and um, unmarried couples are as a result of withdrawal method did you know that anyway let's talk about a few a few points a few reasons why you should not use withdrawal method to prevent pregnancy so for those that know about this method or have used it already and maybe we're lucky or unlucky we need to understand that the chances of getting pregnant with this method are really high because number one reason is that sometimes the sperms escape with the semen the sperms escape with the semen before the man gets to the ejaculation point the point when the man plans to to withdraw his penis so that is the that is the most common point of getting pregnant with withdraw another incidence that could cause pregnancy using this method is sometimes when sperms are deposited around the the woman's pubic area they could easily escape back inside and get to the the uterus of the woman and she if she's ready for for uh, fertilization she could get pregnant so mainly to the girls the young girls out there and the men that are not ready to to have a baby this is not a safe method remember you are not you are just trying to protect from pregnancy which pregnancy the percentage is low the efficiency of this method is really low 40 percent like oh my god so like we can see it's really risky like personally i take it like as a risk thing and i wouldn't advise anyone out there to look at it as a measure of prevention of pregnancy so if you are not ready to have a baby it's better to discuss with your partner and then meet the doctor and find out how you can best prevent pregnancy other than taking a risk <laughs>